Magandang 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 umaga po sa inyo lahat Alam po ninyo sa Batangas Sikat na sikat ang B Kaya Batangas B Una-una dyan alam ninyo Barakong kape Pangalawa Balisong Pangatlo Vulcan Pangapat Beaches uh, Panglima Bagoong Bagoong Balayan Alam ba ninyo kung bakit napakasarap ng bagoong balayan? Dahil iginigiit ng paa. Kaya masarap yung bagoong balayan. <laughs> At ang pinakasikat sa Batangas na B ay walang iba kundi si Bilma. <laughs> Alam ba ninyo? Alam ba ninyo? I'm very happy to be here today. Uh, sa katunayan, meron kami yung budget hearing pero tinawagan ako ng aking kaklase, si Manolet, at sabi nga, iniimbita ako ni Mayor Isko sa araw na ito uh, to be a part of this program today. Sino makakatanggi naman kay Mayor Isko? Di ba? Una-una. Kaya mabibindbin yung budget ng DILG at PNP ngayon. But having said that, lahat tayo na nandito, at kahit wala dito ngayon, lahat tayo may stake sa Manila. Ito yung capital ng Pilipinas. No? And that's why Ayala is here as well. I'd like to thank the private sector for uh, doing what they can in helping the city of Manila. Of course, with the leadership of the vice mayor, our mayor, our, our councillors, and all the public officials here in Manila. So congratulations to all of you. No? But I'd like to take this opportunity as well na Unang-una, um, uh, makita ko yung mga kababayan natin sa Manila, makabisita sa City Hall, at personally, makongratulate ko at mabati ko ang ating mahusay na mayor who has provided very good leadership in this time of pandemic dito sa uh, siyudad ng Maylila. No? Kanina pinag-uusapan natin yung, namin yung response ng Manila sa pandemya na kinakarap natin ngayon. No? Uh, napakaraming testing centers dito sa Manila napakaraming natutulungan ng mga kababayan natin maging mga tricycle driver jeepney driver yung mga nagtitinda sa palengke lahat libre pag na, nagpa-test dito sa Manila no? so magandang ehemplo to meron mga isolation facilities at may ayuda na tinutulong ang city government sa mga higit na nangangailangan Kasama na din yung mga studyante, mga teacher, at kung sino pa dito sa lungsod na Manila. No? He has provided hopeful leadership. At alam natin that Manila will be able to recover immediately from the pandemic faster than many other places in the country, I suppose, and to be able to build back better. Kahit wala pa yung pandemia, nakikita na natin ang naumpisa ni Mayor Isko, and it is very impressive. No? So, with that, let me congratulate the mayor for his ability to work with everyone, to get people together, uh, the vice mayor, the councillors, the officials of the city, the private sector, coming together to build Manila. No? So, hindi ko na rin pahabaan, I thank the mayor for his leadership. At nakakatuwa na nakikita natin na um, we have young leaders like Mayor Isko not only is he good for Manila, but also good for the country. That halimbawa siya na sa uh, local government, pwede pa lang maging ganito. No? So again, Mary Cho, thank you for having me. Thank you for your leadership. I know that the future is bright, and I look forward to having coffee with you. Maraming salamat. Thank you very much, Paul, Senator. At this point, we would like to give the floor to our partners from the Ayala Group. May we invite Mr. Bobby D, President and CEO of Ayala Land, to share with us a few words. Uh, Mayor, Mr. Moreno, uh, Senator uh, Ralfetto, uh, Vice Mayor San Lacuna Pan, uh, Mr. Charlie Dumo, uh, Chief of Staff, Mr. Cesar Chavez, uh, City Engineer, Armand Andres, members of the City Council, our friends from the Rotary, uh, Club of Manila, and RM Sala, Ayala Poli, uh, good morning. 
Patanggalin ko muna ito. Nahihirapan ako. <laughs> anyway, may salamin naman ako. Uh, first of all, uh, on behalf of uh, the Ayala Group of Companies, I would like to say that it is really an honor uh, for us to be part of the milestone of the city of Manila. Uh, two days ago, uh, the Ayala Group also had the privilege of inaugurating with you the Manila Molecular Testing Laboratory at the Santa Ana Hospital. We know that this project is an important step in protecting your community from the pandemic. It was a very meaningful collaboration for us, and we thank you uh, for the opportunity to support you in this effort. Today, we are turning over another facility that we hope will serve your constituents and visitors very well and for many years to come. For us, projects like these are good opportunities for us to serve the community. We are very happy to support your vision for Cartilla and Katipunan Park. We know that this will promote your tourism initiative. We also believe that ancillary developments, such as this public convenience facility, will complete the area. To be able to do it here, in a place that celebrates our history, makes it all the more significant. Our company's history is deeply rooted in Manila. I think nasabi ata mayor nung boss namin the other day that our mother company, the Ayala Corporation, was established here in 1834. And we maintained our partnership with the city over the years through our projects. Ayala Foundation, Ayala Land, Manila Water, BPI, Globe, and more recently, AC Health are all actively part of the community. Ayala Foundation has been involved in the development of Manila's youth for many years through the Centex School in Tondono. It is a school that supports bright and talented students who are under-resourced. The foundation is also currently working with Manila on an education program that uses technology to prepare students and teachers for the workplace of the future. And nakikinig ako kanina kay Mayor dun sa AIM. And I know technology, digitalization, it's a very big part of uh, what the city of Manila is currently doing. So hopefully, what the foundation is doing will be able to prepare you know, uh, people in Manila to be able to further you know, improve, further elevate uh, the digitalization efforts here in the city. Ay, kami po, Ayala Land, in particular, we've established residential developments here in Manila. Uh, there are Avida Towers and San Lazaro, which has been here since 2009. Avida Towers, Intima, and Prime Path, Saladon Park by Alveo, and Amaya Skies, Avenida, and Santa Mesa. Finally, uh, we also operate Tutuban Center, which we envision as a central economic hub. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you, uh, Mayor Isco, Vice Mayor Honey, and your team for the valuable support you have given our company through the years. We know that without your support, we will not be able to bring our plans to life and realize our vision as a company. And again, I was you know, nakikinig ako kanina, Mayor. So checking ko nga sa team namin kung ginagamit na yung Go Manila, which actually helps in terms of easing uh, to do business here. No? So checking ko rin na hindi sila 11.59 nagbayad ng taxes kahapon. Last day ng third quarter. So hopefully, uh, nagamit yung platform at uh, hindi 11.50 lang na gabi ginamit just for the deadline. So, as we continue to work together, we hope we'll be able to create not only economic opportunities for millennials, but also socially relevant projects that celebrate our common aspirations as a people. To close, I'd like to congratulate the City of Manila, led by Mayor Isco and Vice Mayor Honey, for what you have done here at Cartilla and Katipunan Park. We have transformed this area for the next generation of Manilenios. It is a place to be proud of with facilities that make it pleasant and safe for people to visit and appreciate history. Especially now with everyone concerned about health, we hope that the modern facilities here will further promote cleanliness and sanitation and serve the community well. Uh, Mayor Scott, when we met together with our Chairman uh, Fernando Zobel de Ayala last year, it was truly encouraging to see your vision and great plans for Manila. I know that the transformation of the criteria is just one of many. Your projects reflect your heartfelt commitment to the Filipino people 
and we are very glad to be part of this. Congratulations, uh, Mayor. Uh, congratulations, Vice Mayor, and the whole City Council. Uh, and we wish you all the best in your projects. Thank you. Maraming salamat at magandang umaga sa inyo. Maraming salamat po, Mr. B. The Cartilia ng Katipunan Public Convenience Facility Project came about as part of Ayala's commitment to the preservation and promotion of a city as historically and culturally rich as Manila. As we take pride in our beloved city, we also take pride in our own country, the Philippines. As a symbol of our shared pride and love for our country, the Ayala Group is turning over 104 Philippine flags to the, Manila, to the Department of Tourism and Cultural Arts of Manila as part of its efforts to promote love of country and to honor the Kagitinan of Malinenos. May I invite Mr. Bobby B, Mr. Roel Maranan, Ms. Sel Amores, and Ms. Ruena Tomeldan of the Ayala Group to please come forward to symbolically turn over a Philippine flag to the Honorable Mayor Francisco Isco Moreno de Magoso, Vice Mayor Hani Lacunapangan, and Mr. Charlie Dungo of the Department of Tourism and Cultural Arts of Manila.